Area 51 synonymous with UFOs, alien sightings, and secret government programs to keep all of this information hidden from us. So when two individuals videotaped what seemed to be a UFO being transported in the dead of night in the Nevada desert near to Area 51, it raised a few eyebrows. Mark, I want to show you this video. Hold on to your hats. This could be the evidence and the information that we're waiting for. This could be the moment where I, you, you see me eat my words live right here on the Lib TV. Let's take a look at the video and then let's talk about it. Okay, so <laughs> you're laughing. Yeah. What, what are you laughing for? That to me is... Uh, that's pretty... That's pretty clear evidence. That looks that's like UFO, that's a craft that is not something that is familiar to me in size or shape. It's being transported. It's at nighttime. We've got two individuals who are surreptitiously filming it. They're clearly nervous because they're not talking. They're keeping it. It's from the side of the road. Go ahead. Give me your analysis. So they're sitting in the parking lot just minding their own business, eating a double cheeseburger. I, I'm not questioning the source at this point. And they just happen you. to have video rolling. When this caravan comes by, carrying a what looks like a flying saucer. Thank you. From from Lost from in the Space, future. you know, from Lost in Space, from 1967 television show, and it's lit, and it has even red lights around it. True. Well, no, those red lights I think are the police part of the police escort because you wouldn't just move something like this. Well, it looks like there's lights around the edge of the thing. Oh yeah, it looks like it's so sort of on. There's lights on the thing. They have light, like they're trying. They're so secretive that they put spotlights on the actual craft while they're going down have the highway. You, okay, have you never heard of the phrase "hiding in plain sight"? Ah, I see. They're pulling a little fast one on us. Yeah, I mean, where's the most obvious place to hide see? something like that at Area 51? Right. right in the middle of a place like this. Yeah. Okay. Now, there's a number of theories that this could be photoshopped. But then the people, debunkers are always going to say that. Number two, there's a number of other theories that it could just be a toy of some sort. But then why would you do it in the middle of the night? Why have a police escort? There's also a theory that it might actually be a drone, which looks a lot like this. No, not that drone. There's another drone. That. That's an actual mm. naval drone. No, it doesn't look like that. Okay. What it looks like to tell me, me what it is. I'll tell you what it is. And I don't know this for a fact, but I think that some of our viewers will jump on and go, you dumbass, it's right at the corner of highway, whatever. It, it, it seems like something you would put at a roadside attraction. Like we just saw with the, you know, the alien standing up at a restaurant, like the Pee Wee Herman dinosaur. You know, the old school roadside attraction. They're, at, they're in the area of Area 51. It's a tourist area, and they put out this, like, you know, spaceship flying saucer as an attraction. That's what it looks like to me, because it's it doesn't look like something why, they're trying to hide. Why the secrecy? There is no secrecy. They're going down a fucking freeway. Oh, with a, you're just like all the with others. A spotlight on it. You see, you see, I present him with facts. I present him with video evidence. It's not grainy. It's video evidence, <laughs> and this is the response I get. Ridicule. <laughs> it does strike me as slightly strange that if you're going to have an alien craft that you're moving through, you wouldn't even bother covering it up a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, even to, I mean, that seems mm. a little bit. Might want to shut the light off. Too. Yeah, just turn it off a you bit, know, maybe. Make sure there's nobody videotaping at the, at the in and out Burger on the well, corner. Well, <laughs> doing whatever they were doing. But it was so good while it lasted. For those five seconds, yeah. you're like, got him. Got him. Because it, okay. it wasn't the normal handshaky stuff either. Ah, uh, yeah. Not buying it? Not buying it. What a shame. What a shame. Another one just slipped through my grasp. All right, let us know your thoughts. Give us the details on this, what actually is happening down there. Let us know your thoughts. Thanks for being with us here. Subscribe to the UFO-friendly Lip TV.